Hello everyone. Today I will show you how you can set custom settings in Top Lead Extractor software. Click on the setting button, a new window will open. You can see here some tabs are available, so we will start from the first tab, here you can set URL settings. In the first box, we have mentioned some keywords, the software will never crawl URL links having these keywords or domains, you can also add new keywords or domains here as per your need. We will discuss these settings when we will extract leads from websites, basically, these are the crawling settings, you can set custom settings from where you want, and what you want to crawl and extract. When you are going with keyword base extraction, then you have to put your desired keywords here. For example, software companies, which means if the crawled page has these keywords, then the software will pick the URL from here to extraction only. Sometimes there are some characters that are non-readable, so you can replace them with another as shown in the example. Here you can put the text that you want to remove before extraction, you can add multiple keywords per line. You can omit the pages from where you don't want to make extraction, if these words are existing then the software will omit the pages. Put here your keywords to tell the software, the software can extract data from only those pages where these keywords must contain. You can add multiple keywords here per line. If you want these keywords must contain on the page title, then enable this option, and enable this option you want all of your keywords must contain on the page from where the software will extract your data. Click on the phone filtering tab to set the phone number setting. Click here and select the country name from where you want to make extraction. Here country codes are shown, you can write in multiple formats because different peoples write in a different format. Here phone codes are shown, you can also write more mobile codes as per your need. Here area codes are shown from where you want to extract numbers. You can also add new area codes and click this button to save them. You can match the phone code at any side of the number from this drop down, left side, right side, or any side. Enable if you want to get only mobile numbers, and enable this option if you want to fetch landline numbers. If you enable both options then the software will pick both numbers from search engines. You can set the mobile number minimum length according to your country because different countries have different number size, set the mobile number maximum length. You can also set special characters in the number as you want, you can set the limit of dashes, dot, spaces and comma from these drop downs. Sometimes on the web page data is available in correct format like 123456789 continuously, so you can restrict the software will not pick that kind of numbers. Here we can tell the software to discard these kinds of numbers that are showing like date format, you can enable options as per your need. You don't need to do anything with this. Now click on the email filtering tab, you can see that here multiple filters options are available. If you don't want to extract an email where any specific words are existing you can add here, as like we don't want to fetch emails containing the word hotmail, you have to put that keyword here, software will never extract that emails. Here you can match these words from any side of the email address, like the left side, right side, and also any side, it depends on your requirements. If you want to extract emails containing any specific word, you have to put that keyword here, as like Gmail, Yahoo, etc. Sometimes there are some leads having incorrect words, like dot symbol, or at the rate of, are available in the text form as shown here. You can put that word here software will automatically replace it with the correct symbol. Here you can set the maximum length of email addresses that will extract. If you want to extract emails from specific domains, as shown in the example you can enable this option, software will extract emails only in your defined format.
You have to select contacts types from here that you want to extract, like emails, phone number, Skype ID, fax number, Yahoo, etc. Here we have defined the separators for each messenger like comma, dot, semicolon, etc. Sometimes your computer shut down unexpectedly, and your extracted data lost. So you can enable this option and autosave your extracted data, then you can load your last search results with a single click. Enable this option and put a number of records, the software will automatically save data after every written number. Click here to avoid recrawling and prevent duplication, it's better for you if you keep default options. Here you can see crawler settings, if you are an expert person, you can also change these settings. I just want to show you one important thing here, you can enable this option to use the browser to load your pages while execution. In this way you can avoid blocking from search engines. From here you can set the user agent string, if you want to set a random user agent for each request then enable this option. If you want to extract leads only of any specific country, or from a specific country's websites, you can apply filter with the country level domain from here, the software will extract leads only from your selected domains, for example, USA domain is the .us, Pakistan domain is .pk, etc., because these are the international domains and most of the companies has international domains. And if your desired country domain is not available here you can add from here. When we are requesting again and again then there are many websites or search engines that block our IP address, so we can add proxies here, you have to proxy IP here, you can add multiple proxies. You have to add a port number in the same sequence as your proxies in the above box. And if your all proxies have the same port you can put a single port number here. For proxy authentication enable this option and put usernames and passwords in the same sequence as you have put proxies. Now click on this button, and if you want to update any proxy select and click this button, update the proxy, and again click here. Untested proxies will be in black color, working proxies will be green and the proxies that are not working are red color. We have added some keywords here for resolving CAPTCHA on runtime, you can also add more keywords as per requirements. When you have done all settings, you can apply changes from here, it will for the current search. And if you want to save these settings for all time, then click on the permanently save all settings button. Click on the search now button to start extraction, you can see here software has start extraction. These are the statistics, domain count fetched contacts, pages parsed, and URL in the queue. If you want to pause the extraction then click on the pause button, and to stop the extraction click on the stop button. Now I will show you how you can extract data from a specific site or from a collection of websites. You have to put your desired website URL here from where you want to make extraction. You can also put a websites list here. I'm going to extract data from toofinelocal.com. Searching here software companies. The basic objective of this video is to show you custom settings only so I will leave all other things here. Click on this button to add website URL in extraction. We have to set some custom settings here. Select the country name where such website exists, and you want to extract numbers.
here we have to put some word that must contain in the URL as shown in the example. You can see here two words are existing in the URL from where we want to make extraction, first is to find local, and the second word is software, if we go to other pages these words are existing. In this way we restrict our software goes towards only these URLs and omit all others. Put the keywords here software will extract only if the pages have these defined words. Click on apply changes button. To start extraction click the search now button.